Hey guys, welcome to the video. So in this video, I'm going to cover 10 major reasons why students get visa refusal. Well, there are many other reasons behind the refusal, but here I'm going to cover the 10 major points which you can think while applying for the visa for the first time or even if you're applying for second, third or, or multiple times. Don't get stressed. Just look into these points carefully and think about covering all these points when you are filing your visa. So before starting this video, I also want to tell you guys, if you are new to this channel, I usually post content related to help students for their journey to Canada. So please consider subscribing it. Without further ado, ado, let's get started. First, failure to provide accurate and supporting documents. Sometimes students forget to show enough documents while filing their visa. But if you forget to show some of your documents which are important while filing visa, it may also lead to refusal. Second, failure to show required financial resources to finance your education and travel and stay in Canada. Third, failure to meet international security standards such as cases where the applicant has criminal background or record. Fourth, failure to meet health standards. Sometimes it may also lead to refusal when you are having certain health problem and during medical test, the IRCC may get to know what health problem you have. So it may also lead to refusal. Fifth, selecting irrelevant program of studies means the applicant choose a program which is irrelevant from their previous background and their education. So please choose relevant program. Sixth, failure to demonstrate English language requirement. If, if the applicant has lower IELTS score, like if you have 5.5 band scores in one or two or any module, it may also lead to refusal. There are chances when students get visas in this case, but there are also certain chances when it leads to refusal. So it all depends upon the luck for filing visa with 5.5 band scores. Seventh, failure to provide accurate and proper travel history so you have to show proper travel history for the countries which you travel other than Canada or if you are traveling in the Canada for the first time second time so you have to show your travel history while filing the visa seventh this is gonna be the major reason if you are hiding your USA visa refusal it may also lead to ban the applicant so please don't hide this detail while filing visa Eighth, intent of return to your home country. You should show enough proof of intent that you will return to your home country after completing these studies. Ninth, lack of job prospects in your home country. If the applicant get failed to show the opportunities back in their country, like after completing the education from Canada, it may also lead to refusal. If applicant wouldn't able to show their proof and advantages after completing the study what opportunities they get in their home country tenth this is gonna be the last point failure to show enough documents or there is a mistake in your documents so these are all the 10 points which you can consider while filing your visa I hope you will find this video informative and if you guys need any help in visa filing or you are having a refusal you can contact Jolly Immigration Consultants they are very genuine and good in handling files especially for the students who are having a refusal they are having many success stories so you can consider contacting them and if you want the details I will post the link below in the video so guys if you find this video informative please like and comment on this video and please share this video with your friends and family or someone who is filing their visa so that they can cover all these points best of luck guys i hope you can do it and we will meet soon in canada thanks guys have a nice one